In this paper, we propose an approach called overlap net to address the problem of loop closing for lighter based slam for autonomous vehicles. Loop closing means identifying that the robot is at a previously seen place in the context of SLAM. Our overlap net uses a deep neural network and provides the overlap and relative yaw angle estimates between pairs of scans in an end-to-end -end fashion. Based on such estimates, we tackle the loop closing problem integrating overlap net into a SLAM system for wheeled platforms. This is a pipeline overview of our approach. On the left-hand side, you see the pre-processing of the input data. It exploits multiple cues generated from LiDAR scans, including range, normal, intensity, and semantic information, which are shown as different colored image layers. We use all these information as the input to our overlap net. On the right-hand side, you see the architecture of the overlap net, which is a modified Siamese network. It consists of two legs and two heads. The two legs have the same architecture, a fully convolutional network and they share all weights. The two heads use the same pair of feature volumes generated by the two legs. One head is called the delta head, which is used to predict the overlap between pairs of scans. The other head is called correlation head, which is used to predict the relative yaw angle between pairs of scans. The reason why we use overlap to find loop closure candidates, is that, larger overlap values often correspond to better alignment between pairs of point clouds. This is an example. We have two lighter scans. Scan A, colored blue, and scan B, colored orange. If these two scans from the same place are both in the correct locations, the overlap between them is quite high. Otherwise, if they are in the wrong locations, the overlap between them is lower. Our approach is able to predict the overlap without knowing the relative transformation between the scans. This can help us to find loop closure candidates. Here we show the SLAM result after we integrating our overlap net into a 3D LiDAR SLAM system. On the left-hand side, you see the local map of the SLAM. On the right-hand side, you see the corresponding pose graph. The colors of the pose graph represent the translation error with respect to the ground truth. As can be seen, the translation error becomes larger after a long-distance traveling of the car. The red dots represent the loop closures found by our approach. Once it finds a loop, the SLAM system can correct the drift and generate a more globally consistent map. Note that, here it shows that our approach can also find loop closures in a challenging situation, where the car comes back to an intersection from the opposite direction. Here, we show our mapping results in comparison with the original method SUMA. We can see that after integrating our overlap net, the overall odometry is more accurate. Thank you for your attention.